Welcome back to the den, everybody. I am your host, Cory1280, and this is Let's Play Metroid Prime. In the last episode, we got the power bombs and have unlocked the rest of the game, pretty much. Well, almost. And now, going into that save room, I realize that I spawned these guys. Oops. Yeah, four ice pirates. It's unfortunate because I don't have the right weapon to take on all of them at once. There is such a thing, by the way. Wow, where do you go? Yeah, get out of here. Now this other section is uh, Bandesium, but I'm going to leave that for just a, for just this moment because I need to remember which way is which. It is really easy to get turned around in this place. And I mean really easy. It's not going to bug us. Good. Spoilers, he will come out at some point. Thank you. Oh, right. I forgot about this. Alright, today we've got a lot on the agenda. I think that missed. Yeah, the first shot missed. Come on, do something. There we go. Now we're still gonna hit by it. Let's see here. I don't really need that, but okay. Ouch. Just scratched myself. So yes, recorded right after the previous. Always fun. First things first, we're going over here. And setting out a power bomb. Because why not have fun? And we get a map. Finally. Probably gonna be using this a fair bit. <laughs> this place is enormous. Three levels. And yeah, we're gonna be down there soon enough. First things first, however, we need to get back to Talon Overworld. We'll be down there later. Talon Overworld and then Magmore Caverns. for two very specific reasons. Actually, wait, where is that? Oh, I'm going for it, right. Here, drop a power bomb. Why'd I do that? And run through the stinky poo gas, assuming that I don't... What the hell happened there? And time to blow it all away. Bye bye puffers. How that works, I don't know. But it did, so I'm not complaining. Excuse me. <sighs> and we get another energy tank. I believe that is... Four left? God damn. <laughs> this may end up being less than 30... Uh, however many parts I've had in the other games. I don't know. See, down here is the room. Oh, yep, the Cloak Pirates. What am I doing? Where was that? Uh, was that Ventrana? I think it was. Yeah, it was Ventrana. Oh yeah, this is always fun. If you feel like it, you can just knock them right off. Dang. Gotcha. <laughs> I can safely say I have never seen them get stuck like that before. But yeah, shoot right under them. 
right, right on his feet and he'll fall off. And come after you. Oops. Gotta remember, I don't actually have, um... Zoom. Zoom. You never get zoom. I don't have homing with the, uh, with those guys. So over here is that tunnel. That tunnel leads to the next area down, and it's actually more of something that you want to take later. Oh, really? Oh, nope. Unfortunately, I'm kind of running out of power bombs. So there may be some things I can't get to yet. And back up. Now here I'm actually going to kill these guys because they are annoying. Oops. Not sure how I managed to get them, but whatever. I got them. That's the important part, and I think I just got energy. Which is so totally useless. Need missiles and power bombs, and I'm not gonna get them. Alright, we can get that now. Go over here and blow this apart. Oops. The upper yellow controls. Just so you know, the um, connecting rail is on the opposite side. <sighs> Boy, I'm feeling especially chatty tonight. This is unusual. Oops. And in we go. Oh, come on. It had stopped. Whee! And ah, there it is. Now if you yell, you've really got to look at the guide down at the bottom. There we go. And now we never have to bother with that again. There it is. We will not actually be needing to go to any of the other levels. Or if we do, then we can just drop down. And up here we get... Oh, this is the last power bomb area. Shoot. Well, whatever. We get an old friend. Why she can shoot from it, I have no goddamn clue. That's something that they added in the Wii version, and it's just really bizarre. But yeah, we've got our grapple beam back. So now we can go pretty much everywhere. Now, yes. We Out through the waste disposal. Whoa, 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 come on. Not sure what's up with my Wiimote. It's been having little fits. I think I I think I need to really replace it. Whee! Out we go. Actually. Oh, I forgot to move the crane back. Shit. Oh, I can just do that from over here. Whoops. Ow, 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 ow. Don't have much room to move. Use my lead. <laughs> yeah, lead. Ow. Never mind. I was gonna say lead, uh, Toho skills, but I don't, really don't have any. I don't know. Yeah, you really don't need the crane in the position that's in now. Ouch. And, uh, just after you get the missile tank, just move it back to here and be done with it. For some reason, you can't skip it. But whatever. And that is a grapple point. Oh, speaking of which, we need to scan it, because it's a research. And let's just get out of here. Yeah, I know you're back there. Here, I have electric death.
And back we go. Back to Talon Overworld. And the seedlings. And we need to go to... Let's see here. I'm trying to remember where that is. Oh, that's up here! Right, right, right. We are going to go and get a rather important item. Right now. I say that, but it's not really used that much. At least not in this game, anyways. Should be open. Yes, it is. Come on, you. Shoot your little seedling thingy. Thank you. Bye bye. Yeah, I forgot you had one up there, too. Damn! Freaking seedlings. Actually, I'm amazed that I can remember that name. But whatever. Got a magnetic pole over here. Now, normally you're supposed to go oh, oops, up to the top, but if you're good enough, which I'm not tonight, there we go. You just kind of skip it. Granted, if you went up to the top, you could go up a little higher. But whatever. I don't have any power bombs, do I? No, I don't. Shit. Um. Well, that's a bit of a conundrum. Because I need one to get through there. I think this is good enough. Maybe not. Shit. Eh, <laughs> there we go. Don't want to forget to scan that. Blow up another one, see if I get anything. No, I didn't. No prizes today. How sad. Now, you might notice the rain falling and hitting something here. Well, invisible platform. So I can actually go over there. Normally, you'd need the uh, x-ray visor to get up there. I think I might still. I'm going to give it one more shot, and then I'm going to keep on going. Because I think there's another hidden platform. Elio! Yes! There's nothing much in here, just another missile expansion. But hey, well, every missile counts. Especially in this game when you can use them to power up your weapons so, uh, so much. I'm sure I've probably said this before, but this is still my favorite game of the series. <sighs> Just beca mostly because of the fact that you can switch weapons. I mean, Prime 3, you've only got... <sighs> well... No, I wouldn't say just t uh, two weapons. You get multiple weapons, but they're all fused together for some reason or another. And another half pipe, which we're going to get to the top of. I said we're going to get to the top of. Thank you. For missile expansion. Now the tricky bit. Getting to the middle. Yeah, right there. There we go. Well, I guess it wasn't so tricky after all, huh? Anyways... I need another power bomb. Shit. I just now remember that. But we found the X-ray visor! This can... See through walls and show hidden platforms. Thank you. If I remember right, these things infinitely spawn in here. Maybe. Testing. Okay. 
Sorry about that, my headset cut out. <laughs> oh, here we go again. Honestly, I shouldn't be surprised, but I just... I don't know why it's happening. Alright, I think that should be enough. Maybe. Actually, you know what, no. The nice thing is that, is that these always give you power bombs. Hell yep. So, full power bombs. Welcome to this to the life grove. I was about to call it the sacred grove. I think that's something completely different. Anyways, we have. I think this is bombable, isn't it? Yes. You, you actually need to do this in order to get out. And we see something that I don't think I've collected yet. We'll find out in a moment. But these are key. <laughs> they're pretty much keys, to be honest. But they're key to beating the game. A Chozo artifact. This is the artifact of Chozo. <laughs> Clever name. Seventh of twelve. Yeah, that's the first one. There are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 of them, in all. I think I did miss a bit of pirate data, though. That's a shame. Probably have to put the 100% ending in the, uh, rifle place. That's not good. That's gonna take a while, I think. Well, maybe not. I'll figure something out. Anyways, it's time to go back. Because surely nothing else is going to pop out at us. Pop out and say Ooga Booga. Whoops! Couldn't see where I was going. Time! Wow. These videos are... <laughs> These videos are going by quick. I'm really kind of surprised. Come on, hands, work, work with me. Mouth, work with me. Brain, work with me. Everything, work with me. I like Chozo Ghosts, but now we've got their weakness. We can see them at forever. One super missile generally does it. Ah, unless you don't hit him. Take this. There we go. See that shows a damn it. <laughs> shows a ghost. It's not much of a threat anymore. And now that breaks apart. They give us an escape. I believe I heard everything. So now we go from the life grove. The unfortunately corrupted life grove. We whoops. You would think that they would put you in the right direction, but nope. They really don't. Come on. Here we go. Not sure what that was about, but whatever. Oh yeah, there are still two more things to do in the uh, Chozo Ruins, even. Which I will go to next time. Depending on where... well, no, next time. Elliot! Because I need to go to make more caverns. Okay, okay. Let's see. Save point. Save point. Oh, good. There's that one right there. I haven't been here in a friggin' forever. I suppose we can take care of... well... I said we could take care of business now, but... Well, while we're here, but... I kind of want to go to Magmore Caverns first and get that out of the way. Make things easier. Alright, so next time on Let's Play Metroid Prime, we go to Magmore Caverns once more.
And I just realized you cannot see the grapple beam on her arm. Unless you're in here. Otherwise, no, she doesn't have it on her arm. That's a shame. You could see it in the GameCube version. Anyways, until then, everybody, take care of yourselves. And good night.